Before we begin working in Illustrator, I want to make sure everyone is using the same version, that we have the most updated version. Um, since you're, you purchased this new, I'm guessing you did download the most recent, but it's always smart to check. So on a Mac, we have a little icon up here that is our Adobe Manager. And on your PC, I believe you're going to see it down here at the lower right corner or for sure over in your Start menu. So go ahead and open that, and if you're not logged in, log in. I am. I can see my face here. And this is going to show me what software has updates. And if I have you in Photoshop, we already took care of this for that class, so I see my recently updated is here, but Illustrator does in fact have an update. So I'm going to click on this Update button and let that run. It may take a little while depending on your internet connection. And when it is complete, it will join the group down here of recently updated. So we'll check back on that in a minute. Um, oh, I have it open and it wants me to close it first. So if you happen to have Illustrator open, you're going to get that same message. And you can close it and say continue. Oh boy. Let's quit this. Force quit. I guess it didn't want to quit nicely, so I'll force quit. And then I can continue with the updating. Um, this progress bar will tell you how quickly or slowly it's going, so we'll let this run through. And when it's finished, you will see it down here ready to go. From this panel, you can open Illustrator or you can go on a PC down to your Start button or on a Mac to your Launchpad and find Illustrator wherever it happens to be. So that's one thing I want to make sure you do is have the latest version, 24.2.3, up and running before you follow along with these videos.